Hello everybody, welcome back to Mir no Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch. Now that we are done our first part of Castle Cove, let's start working on side quests here. There is this little girl right here that wants some alchemy to be done. Ah, the best pot you have. Is it a cauldron? Is it not? Uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, you must be a wizard. Thank you. It sounds like this little girl knows a thing or two about wizarding, Ollie boy. I do. I read my wizard book every day. I know all about wizards and the spells they can cast. But the spells, they are not my favorite thing about wizards. It's the alchemy that I love the most. I read that wizards can make almost anything by mixing materials in a cauldron. Is that true? It sure is. It's actually pretty easy if you have the right ingredients. Mm -hmm. It is easy for one such as you, I think. Ah, being a wizard must be very wonderful. Would you? Would you show me how the alchemy works? You can make a candle cutter, perhaps. I have. I heard that candle cutters can only be made using alchemy methods. I would deeply love to see one for myself. Okay? Oh, wonderful. I do not think I have ever been this excited. Now, to make a candle cutter, you will need a flint dagger and an ember stone. Well, we already got ember stones. Something half mine. You don't, you don't have to know your stuff, so... <laughs> It is all in my book. Alright, I shall wait for you here. Please hurry in. I am very excited. Hmm. Do we have a flint dagger? Oh, you have it. Hmm, yeah. Let's see move it. Okay. It's been removed. So we can do it right now. Okay. Um, mix and match. Yeah, we need to go to mix and match since we do not have the formula for this spell. So, mint dagger. Oh yeah, if you get it wrong, you do not lose the item. So, that's useful to know. And... Ember stone. There you are. Mix. Press the square button to mix. Whoa! <laughs> Here you go, you're back, and we bought you a candle cutter. Oh, wonderful, simply wonderful. Some, something so magnificent, free from such a simple material. I can hardly believe it. Well, you better believe it. Wizards like Ollie Boy can do all sorts of stuff. I do love alchemy so. How I wish to become a wizard like you. Oh, perhaps I should give you something to thank you for showing me the candle cutter. Please, fix it. Mm-hmm. Oh, and there's all sorts of formula in my wizard companion. I'll teach you some of them, perhaps. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see what we were given for formula. Okay, we were given the candle cutter, of course. Okay, shadow glass knife. Divine Dagger, Watchman's Axe, Knuckle Bone Claws, oh, some armor, some accessories, okay, and this is all formulas, okay. Right, oh yeah, talk about uh, alchemy, alchemy is one of the, um, let me show you, okay, here and progress report, the alchemy completion Thing I will not be doing. I will, or the creature companion completion. Those are for me very boring and not going to be done. But I am going to show off some alchemy here and there, like show off when it is new weapons for our main characters. But I will be trying to be trying to complete all tasks and all wizard companion and probably the other two parts, which are unknown to us at this moment in time. Okay, 20 guilders, that's useful. And are you one? Yes, you are a side quest here. Ah, uh, yes, yes, that's it. This is the future. Gee, ma'am, you sure do seem happy. No doubt I do. I have 
successfully visualize a swimsuit more elegant than anything that has come before it for the design no joy is comparable I need only acquire the materials and my vision shall be realized. Ah, uh, perhaps you can help. Us? Uh, uh, us, really? Yes, yes, would you do so? Do something for me, perhaps in the name of the ancients and all that is elegant. My new swimsuit design requires a certain material that is rare, but by no means unobtainable. I wonder if you can fetch it for me, perhaps? Mm hmm. That's our next mission to help her build her swimsuit. Oh, thank you. It is rainbow leaves that I require. These are usually carried by floret. Three su suffice, I think. Um, what's a floret? We have met them, Oliver. Keep up, Oliver. They're creatures that roam the shimmering sands, ain't it, they? You must have seen a couple. The thing is with rainbow leaves, though. Ah, this fairy knows his faction, I think. There is indeed an additional complication. The rainbow leaves that fairies carry must be pulled down before you can fix them up. They will otherwise wilt before their very eyes. This makes life difficult, I realize. But the designer's lot has never been easy. But how do we met to pull them down if the forts are holding them? Hmm, oh. The icy spell you've got again. Fuck by ain't it? You try knocking the floor out of that. To keep the leaves nice and cool, I reckon. Mm-hmm. Uncle Fan is Snoopy, let's give it a try. Yeah, let's do so. Uh let me check my locker. Totally empty, good. Okay. Let's see. So uh, they are some Let's see, there's some hearts here and there's two hearts and a side quest left for us to open up. So let's get that done. Picking this up. Oh, some chocolate. Good. Let's see. Let's get some hearts. Let's get a heart from this lady. Hmm, what should I prepare for dinner tonight? I wonder. Are you cooking dinner, miss? And indeed I am. There is an old lady who lives alone near here, you see. I assist her with domestic tasks and so on. So you're her maid, huh? <laughs> oh, nothing like that is merely something that I choose to do. The old lady she cared for me when I was a child. I am merely repaying the very many favors she performed for me. There ain't a lot of people who do that kind of thing without asking for a single guild in return, you know? Yes, well, this one's got more kindness in her little finger than most folks have not in your own body. Um, excuse me, miss. We are wondering if you be help it will help us with something. Hmm? You require my assistance? That's right. We are hoping you will be able to share a little bit of your kindness with us. That's somebody who needs it, you see. Hmm. If it will help someone who is in need, how could I possibly refuse? Thank you very much, miss. Mm-hmm. Take part. Mm -hmm. Some more kindness to us. And that? What well, I might help someone give me the greatest satisfaction. Mm -hmm. Some more kindness. And let's see, there's another heart right here. Oh, there's a chest here. Oh, a ah, cutscene! Everybody here is wearing swimsuits, huh? Yes. No wonder they call it the Sunshine Paradise of the South. Look, oh, they are not dressed correctly. Oh, thank you, boy. <laughs> That's very disrespectful. Huh? What? Snickers! It's like Ding Dong Dale over, over, over a fifteen again. Mm-hmm. Super. Come on, come now. What is the disturbance? Ah, Governor! The very person we need. The Governor? What do you have here? Hmm. You are visitors to our town, I take it. You must know that all who enter this place are required by law to wear the appropriate attire. I speak, of course, of the bathing suit. What? But that guy's not wearing a bathing suit. Well, maybe he is under all that stuff. 
but we ain't planning on moving here, is, is it? We're just passing through life. Nevertheless, the law must be obeyed. The dark days of the past cannot be revisited. We once, once had great trouble here. I'm sorry? Did you hear that? You never think it look at a place now. It's so peaceful. It was a time of great sadness. Travelers from all over our world would sail to Castaway Cove. Travelers do not always see eye to eye. The men of the sea are heart beat, but quick tempered. Without the constant supervision, they would soon fall upon one another in anger. And for this reason, I devised a means of maintaining the peace. I am sure you have guessed already what it was. Huh? Yes, to require all those in the town to wear speeding suits, of course. Huh? What is he? Lifting crackers or something? What difference uh, would that make? A great difference in these fairy. For a, in a speeding suit, one cannot conceal a weapon. <laughs> and no matter where your homeland would be, all who, who come here must dress in the same manner. Be they from Alma Moon, from Ding Dong Dell, or from the farthest long islands of the north. When they don the bathing suit, they become citizens of Castaway Cove. Now that's interesting, but it's such a strange idea. How did you convince everyone to agree? Ooh, at first, of course, I met with ridicule from all sides. None would support my scheme. Yeah, I am not evil. But I do not waver. I remain true to my vision. I put away my resentment and my frustration. And why I was able to show some restraint. Because I had a dream. A dream of peace in the place of my birth. Gee, I thought they were dressed like that because it was so hot. Me <laughs> too. <laughs> you are not the first to think so, but this only proves how peaceful our town has become. Such a misunderstanding is a happy one. Understand now, we would respect the governor's wishes and dress like everyone else. Let's do it. I want to become a citizen of Castle Cove. Alright then, we, if we slipping must, but I ain't got a swimsuit, have you? <laughs> Worry not, little one. We have a great wealth of bathing suits prepared for visitors such as yourself. Come, you will follow me to my home, and they are free. Check me out, Dolly Boy. I look the business in this little number. Huh? Yeah, you do. Oh, that's marvelous. <laughs> What do you think? Mm, looks good. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Lake. We may be boys, but we ain't entirely ignorant of the more involved nature of feminine dress. Eh, Ali boy? Uh, I, I guess. Uh, anyway, we're all citizens of Castaway Cove now. Let's go take a look around. Thank you very much, Mr. Governor, sir. <laughs> the bathing suits are yours now. You must wear them whenever you visit us. Now, at least I can say to you, welcome to Castle Cove. Thank you. And now, at least we can go and look for a flipping boat. So talk about that, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got the bathing suit. Yeah. Still, that's his only name. He's just known as Governor. No actual name is given to this character. Um, you see, we already got, oh, too hard, I skipped over because of the cutscene. And the chest, let's check the chest first. Okay, so it's blue chest, so I can break it with spring lock. Sometimes I have trouble telling between purple and blue. A fish burger. Okay. Uh, let's see, you are the heart on the boat. What a wonderful weather. A sign from the ancients that I am due to a bountiful hall, perhaps. So you're a fisherman, huh? I uh, most certainly am. And I am um, just about to head out to sail. See, ain't you ain't a bit worried about all the monsters that have popped up around here then? Monsters? 
Ah, oh, no fisherman is worthy of this name would have such if concerning a moment stop. You are not scared of monsters? Of course not. Why, I have already survived one monster attack. I drove those creatures away then. And if necessary, I shall do the very same thing again. Let's see, heck, man, you can well, smell the courage on this one. You still sure can. Excuse me, sir. Uh, would you uh, like to ask a favor? A favor? But I must set sail soon. At least I miss the fair wind and the bountiful howls they bring. Oh, it will only be a few seconds. We must. We just want to borrow a little your courage. My courage, certainly. It's not something I lack. Here, take as much as you wish. Thank you, Mr. Fishman, sir. Okay, take your courage. The press again. Even though it does not look like the Crest of Courage. Oh, thank you. You are finished already? Uh, a tingling sensation in my chest. That was my heart. <laughs> At least they act odd to it. I see. You are the one who needs the, needs a heart. And I need something. Curses. What is this affliction I suffer? Um, are you okay? You don't look so good. I, I have always been a man with teeth. Becoming a fisherman, it would only, only a fisherman ever since I was a babe in arms. And indeed, I was recently able to finally acquire my very own vessel. Oh wow, that's great praise. That's great praise. Congratulations. I am grateful for your kind words, but uh, I suddenly find myself to be most terribly afraid of this ocean, the ocean I've always loved. I simply cannot bring myself to go fishing. What has become of me? I do not know. A fisherman who suddenly scared the sea. It's trippy. It sounds like he's broken hearted, ain't it? Lacking courage, he is. We just got courage, that's good. No doubt about it. You going to help him out, party boy? Mm hmm. Of course I am. I sure am. I mean, he just got his own boat. Hey, oh, I see. Alright then, let's see if we can find some courage for our future main friends. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's give Jake give heart and give him the courage he needs. Mm, oh, oh, praise to the ancients. Courage dwells within my breast once again, once more. Okay. Nico, so you are not scared of the sea anymore. Not in the slightest. Indeed, I shall pick the waves forthwith. Ah, but first I must show you try to be success this by way of things. Mm-hmm. Two fish burgers. Okay, that's good. Now we are done the side quest we can get done and that's all the hearts. So let's get out of here. And Continue. Mm. Do we have monster? Do we have already have the monster hunt? Okay, yes, yeah, so we have the three monster hunts. Let's see. Can I do? Can I do? Can I do? Okay, these monster hunts cannot be done until we get the boat. Yes, our next option is boat. So let's get our boat. Alright, let's get the, the third side quest done now. You have to leave the city for a second. And find those ferrets. Uh, we will cut to the ferret battle. We're under attack. Okay, we got our ferret. One of our ferret battles. So let's well, fight the ferret. Gotcha. Okay, that should be how we get our thing. Nice flash. Yes, got the rainbow leaf. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, we got oh, two of them. That's useful. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, that's the beast. Ah, thank you. That probably might not get us our second one. Ah, we only got one. So let's just kill it before we could get our second, our third. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Okay, here we are to our last one we need. Stay calm now. Okay, let's see. So let's fight on you. Gotcha. Fireball. Okay, that should be our last requirement. Yeah. Now let's get back to... Mm -hmm. Thank you for telling us that. Now let's get back to Castaway Cove. We're running right there. Okay, we're back in Castaway Cove. Now let's find the bathing suit lady so we can give her her item so we can finish off the side quest that we can finish off at the moment. I brought you these rainbow leaves that you wanted. Yes, yes, they're perfect, I think. You have done the world of fashion a great service, young man. So you can make the swimsuit now? I can, most certainly I can. You are hardly witnessing the birth of a new and exciting important friend. The role in this realization shall not be forgotten. Of course, please accept this token of gratitude and do not forget me when you have need of a designer. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got another set of cards done. So, let's, mm, let's check the pillar. I think they can sell weapons here. Yeah, they do. Let's see about a weapon. Hmm. Let's give it to him. And you could use it. Let's see, and my dragon could use this. Okay. Okay, hmm. Let's increase the guy's shield. Okay, that's useful. Okay. Yeah, some stuff that's good. So let's go uh, check out the place over here. See if I can give any more. Um, yeah, I can't claim those yet. Let's see, I have two now, so I can get the last one. Good. Jackpot. Oh, the additional restoration glims appear during battle. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Now, let's see, the iron board is empty. Good. We're done for the side quest now. Okay, so we'll continue getting our folks next time here in Castle Cove. See you then. Bye.